Hello everyone and welcome back to another monthly favorites video. You know the drill, we're going to be talking about all our favorite fashion, beauty, books and all those bits from the month of What's the April, month? May. Wait, April, no. May. You know, let's just start, let's get into we it. We like these things. So the first thing I've got here is this Chi Chi beauty sponge thing for applying your foundation. I put this in our beauty haul that we did a couple of weeks ago and I hadn't tried it yet and I have now and I really like it and I use it every day and I specially washed it for this video but it's still kind of stained. I don't know why I find it so entertaining. You're like playing with it. <laughs> I know, I like, I like, I like doing the on my face. <laughs> my first beauty favourite for the month is this MAC blush that my friend Alex got me for my birthday and I think it's in the shade Fleur Power. Um, but I just think it's really pretty. I'm wearing it today and it's a really nice simple everyday sort of colour and I feel like it complements my skin tone really well. It doesn't make me look too red and this was my first time trying a matte blush and I was pretty impressed. I enjoyed it. So my next favourite is this Ardell brow pomade kind of thing. It's like the Anastasia dip brow. You have a brush and you dip it in and you draw on your eyebrows. When I first looked at it in the pan I thought it was going to be way too like reddy brown toned but it's actually quite an ashy colour and it's a little bit darker than what I usually go for for my brows but I really like it. It's not as creamy as the Anastasia dip brow so I actually find it quite easy to put on in comparison and it comes with a really good brush. Do you like it better than the Anastasia? I don't know if I can say that yet, but <laughs> the past two months, like, I kind of haven't been using my dip brow, I've just been using this. So the other day I went to use my oil and I realized I've literally used up half a bottle and then it kind of registered, oh yeah, I really like this. So I decided to chuck it into the favorites video. Um, and Tiffany's actually sent us like a full range of their oils, which was really cool. But this was my favorite, it's the Chia and Kiwi Seed Superfood Serum. And it's just really good for oily skin. I like to put it on at night, it just sort of soaks in while I sleep. And it smells really good too. It smells like nature. You said it was good for oily skin. Did you mean dry skin? Oh yeah. That's right, we'll just put a star in a dry. So my first fashion favorite will be no surprise if you follow me on social media because Snapchat, Instagram, Twitter, I've been posting these all the time. These are my new sunglasses from Shop Enemy. They're from an LA brand called Kimono. Shop Enemy is the like shop of a YouTuber named Chelsea Wears. And I really like her channel and I've been looking at her shop for so long and I finally bought a couple of things and I'm just beyond happy with them. I'll be your can you not? sunglass model. Can you not? Can I have them back? I'm scared you'll never give them back now. I'm gonna sneeze on them. No. No. Boom. Nice. 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 My fashion favorite for the month is this guy right here. That was so awkward. I'm not very smooth. But it's this watch. It's from The Timekeepers, which is a New Zealand brand. And I just really enjoy wearing it. I put it on and I'm like, I look so stylish now. Like it just ups the outfit. Do you even use it to check the time? <laughs> like all Maybe. the description <laughs> of it, you're like, it looks great, it's yeah. stylish. I use my watch to like check the time. No. So my next favorite, which is another very exciting purchase for me. I've been on a roll with getting like investment pieces the past couple of months because I've started working full time. But it is my Rebecca Minka bag. I didn't watch my the bag dubs. video. Cure the dubs. <laughs> I didn't watch my bag video about this, so you can go watch that if you want more details. But I just really like it, and whenever I go out and I don't need to take an entire like my life with me in a bag, this is the bag I take, and it just ah, oh, so hardware, black leather. Maybe I could just wear it for the rest of the video like this. Why not? Why not? My fashion favorite is not as exciting as that, but it's these Zara culottes which we got when we were in Melbourne. And I've just found that I've been wearing them a lot because they're so versatile. I can dress it up with a white shirt and a blazer, or I can throw on like a grey t-shirt and some like sneakers. I just think you can wear them anywhere and Zara's really nice quality. And Zara's coming to New Zealand this year, so I'm so excited. <laughs> the feel. So for book favorite this month, I am going to say my healthy food guide, which is technically a magazine, not a book, but <laughs> what a rebel. Details. In our weekly vlog, I tried making the mushroom vegetarian patties, and they turned out pretty good. They always have nice recipes in here, and I just, it's so good, it's so informative, it's accurate because they actually get qualified people to write in it. I'm just, I'm just a bit of a nutrition nerd, so <laughs> I just, 
it excites me. My book favorite is this one. It is A Walk to Remember by Nicholas Sparks. We all love a good Nicholas Sparks read, admit it, he's, he's a good one. Um, I got this at a second hand store for like $8 and I didn't really know what the book was about but I picked it up anyway and I loved it. It's like a really nice, light, easy read and the ending is just all the feels. I don't really have a TV show or movie favorite. I've just been watching the Gilmore Girls on repeat. <laughs> that would probably be your favorite then, pretty much. Are you up to season seven? Yeah. Yeah. And when did you start this endeavor? Like the beginning of semester. Like seven yeah, weeks. It's all right. It's like a season a week. Season <laughs> week. <laughs> Twenty episodes a week. So in terms of what I've been watching, I did see Batman vs Superman twice, <laughs> but I still wouldn't put it in my favorites because it had so much potential to be better. So I thought I would mention a couple of YouTubers I have been loving recently. First one is Tessa Violet. She's been in YouTube for years and years and years. And her videos are just so good. She does musical ones and she does like chatty ones. So we'll link her down below. And I've also been enjoying Wheezy Waiter, who's another YouTuber that's been around for years, but he's recently switched up his video style and doing daily vlogs. And he always used to do week like daily videos. But recently he's just been changed his style and I really I'm really digging it. You're so, digging it. I'm digging it. So that is the ow! Oh, what are you doing? We're not up to the thumbs up part yet. We're up to this, so this is the end of the video okay. part. Okay. So that's the end of our favourites video. Give it a thumbs up if you liked us and leave one of your favourites in the comments below and we will see you in the next one. Bye! Bye. I'm always up first before Tara. I like to get up early so I have lots of time.